You got to stop looking to others for support and look inside yourself. The lion in you never retreats. Imagine us taking the lion approach to life. I ain't backing up. A lion don't walk backwards for nothing. You got to tell yourself, I can do this. You're more powerful than you realize. You're stronger than you think you are. You can survive more than you think you can. You're more capable than you can possibly imagine. People are gonna think you're crazy. And sometimes you're gonna think you're crazy. You're gonna question yourself. It takes guts, ladies and gentlemen, to go through that. People used to laugh at me in Detroit when I was sleeping on the floor of my office in the Penobscot building. It was rough, ladies and gentlemen, it was not easy. When I was laying on the floor looking out of the window, when I was questioning myself, Les, can you do this? It was necessary that I face a lot of rejection, a lot of laughter, a lot of no's in order to get here, to enjoy the level of success. It was necessary that I face that. And I'm saying to you, when you're facing those rejections day in and day out, don't say, I had a bad day today. Say, I had a character building day. I was questioning myself. When you have a dream, the one thing you have to watch out for are those out there that will try to crush your dream. And you cannot allow that to happen. That is your biggest challenge. It's necessary, ladies and gentlemen, that you look at the people in your life. Who do you have yourself surrounded with? It's necessary, ladies and gentlemen, that you get the energy drainers out of your life, the dream busters. Get them out of your life. They will deplete your energy. They're going to laugh at you. Anybody can believe when the struggle is over. But I want to talk to some people who are in the middle of the struggle and you still believe. I know you're tired. I know your arms are aching. I know your mind is frustrated. I know you feel like it's not fair. I know you feel like throwing up your hands and you're depressed and you lost loved ones and you've been through heartaches and it's not the best time in your life. All hell might be breaking loose in your life and tell them I can do it. If it don't happen, I can do it. If you don't love me, I can do it. If you don't want me, I can do it. If you leave me, I can do it. If you betray me, I can do it. You gotta talk to yourself. Sometimes healing takes place first in the spirit. You gotta tell yourself, I can do this. I got what it takes. I will not be defeated. Wouldn't it be amazing if you believe that? Wouldn't you sleep good tonight if you believe that? Wouldn't you walk around with your head up and your back straight if you believe that? You wouldn't be intimidated by anybody, anywhere, at any time if you just believe that. So you've got to decide, you've got to say, it's possible that I can beat this. It's necessary that I do this. You've got to mobilize your mind and your spirit that I can find a solution. I'm not through yet. I've got some purpose that I've got to fulfill. I've got some work. I have an assignment that's incomplete. I'm not through yet. I'm not going out like this. I'm going to fight. And it's necessary that you take charge, that you begin to stand up with inside of yourself.